Hi, I'm Bowling Otter. And I'm Missy Sandwich. Welcome to the BS. The Bowling Otter Show. Hi. Hello. We wanted to take a quick moment and talk about the Steam Deck. Absolutely. Because I feel like there's a lot to talk about, and we've been touching on it a little bit on our streams, but we wanted to make a quick video just so, I mean, for you and I yeah. to look at this because we, we've we been so busy and we haven't had a chance to actually look at exactly what's going on here. Yeah, yeah. The idea of this so, is amazing to me. Yeah, so bear with us while we figure this out, and I'm curious to see what your guys' comments are because a lot of feelings around this one. So, yeah. Yeah. What's the deal? Okay, so it's it be, it's basically a handheld PC from what I understand. Oh, it's running Steam OS, yes. which is uh, a Linux operating system. So mm -hmm. it's got a. Um, I have never used Steam OS. I'm not sure if that's even been released on a device like this before. Right, right. But uh, it's also apparently just like an AMD x86 processor. So that means you could install Windows on this if you wanted to. You know, that is, like, but will you use will you use Windows on it? Uh, well, would you it just depends. use it to game? It de well, I mean, it's intended to game, right? Right. Uh, so I guess there's like a lot of extra buttons and pads on this thing, it looks like. And like, there's oh, several image 105. different- Oh, image 105, here you go. Okay, it's um, just on screen keyboard there. There's several different versions as well. Are there really? That I just oh. saw, yes. Oh, look, it has a pad so you price. can do like mouse-like things with it, like yes. what, from Steam Controller, but they also put the uh, analog stick where it still makes sense to be. Well, my questions are, number one, yeah. is the battery gonna be three hours? Uh, number two, yeah. is it gonna burn our hands? Yeah. And is it gonna get so hot? I'm really, really curious to see yeah, how what everything it says. Get? I'm, I'm it so get? worried it's gonna get hot. See. Okay, because so. having a hot gaming device, that sounds kind of Lardy, but really, it, it kind of ruins it for you it's a little bit, doesn't device. it? Though, like, do you ever play yeah. on, like a really hot laptop and you're like, oh sweaty yeah, like yeah, like at my and, MacBook, oh, like my it gets so hot, it yeah. actually starts slowing down because it overheats <laughs> yes. if I have it on the bed, so exactly. I have to put it on a lap desk where I can't use it. Right, right, right. Uh, it's ridiculous. You get a little but, air under there, a little exactly. bit of movement. So it's really nice looking. Looks I have like to say that much. Gear. Yeah, I, it does look like a game oh, gear. Game gear. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I am interested, like you said, how hot is it going to get? Yes. How long is the battery life going to be? I don't yes. expect battery life to be very good. Yeah. But uh, if I remember correctly, I think it tra uh, it charges via USB C, so you can actually use like a power bank. With okay. It if you're like traveling or that's, something. That's so, very helpful. Yeah, that's super very helpful. helpful. Yeah, I like that. Um, and it's I like how it's got these touch pads going on here. How how about I click on the wrong thing a hundred times? How about that? <laughs> Here we go. I like these touch pads. I'm curious about the screen. Are there any like there are there specs here? I don't know how I feel about a touchpad. Um, oh, here's the specs. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. How are you feeling about a touchpad? If for this, I think it's in it absolutely oh, for this. like absolutely important because here's the deal. Apparently this just plays your Steam games. It's a PC. So if yeah. that's true and it works like that, then that means that all of the stuff that you have going on, like uh, any game you already own on Steam, you could play with that right out of the box. Yeah. You don't have to port it. Yeah. You know, to this yeah. to the Steam OS platform, and you could just play it. Right. Apparently. Yeah. Um, although. I think, what? Although Steam OS is Linux based, so that if any of the games that weren't Linux work, uh, you were trying to run it, probably wouldn't run unless you jump through the hoops to get Windows on this thing. Mm. That'd be a really good reason to get Windows on it. True. And then you install Steam and then have access to all the Windows games. So. Gosh. All right, jury's out there. Maybe these questions have already been answered. Okay. I don't know, we're just getting in. Yes, we're just diving in. We're like, hey, let's make a quick video yeah. and actually take a look and see what's going on. Oh, and a dock. The a HDMI. Dock. Okay. So it would be a freaking switch. Yeah. But a PC, you could dock it oh and just God. have your whole setup going on. You could pick it up and keep playing. Oh. Same screen, same everything. It's basically the switch applied to a PC. Uh. That's, for me, oh my God. Like. Uh, like this is awesome. I am super excited about this. Wow. No idea how it's gonna perform. Wow. Almost don't care. Well, how do you feel about playing these big epic things? I mean, you can make the same argument for any handheld. Yep. On this on this little thing. There's yeah. some games where I like the big experience. Absolutely. And we've you know talked what I mean? about this before. Yeah, we have. Um and for me, what gets me halfway there is wearing headphones. And just like oh. being, because that worked with me on the on the Vita when I played yeah. like God of War and <laughs> yeah, stuff, you know, right. um, uh, yeah. and like uh, and the PSP, mm -hmm. uh, it really got me into the handheld games. Yeah. If I had, if I just had like I was encased with the audio because then I hear it all around me, oh, and totally. the screen didn't make as much of a difference. Yeah, um, this is seven inch screen. So is that the same as a Switch? Six point two. Oh, so this is bigger. Yes, yes, yes. Than a Switch screen. Okay. All right. By so a decent we'll, amount. We'll have an extra couple of inches of 
<laughs> extra couple inches is F, whatever. All right. It's fine. Let's look at the specs, baby. Two to eight hours of gameplay on the battery. Two to eight. What does that even mean? Like, it's a pretty huge difference. But either way, not a lot. Two and to eight? Wouldn't have expected a lot. Um, I don't know if there's any handheld See, gaming system that actually has good battery life. What handheld gaming out. system? That stresses me out. Yeah. It makes me I would have a backpack full of I power have, banks. Yeah. Well, you know what? It makes my gaming experience feel like it has a time limit on it. Yes. You know what I mean? Yes. And that, I so mean, does being an adult. So does me. Uh, hey. <laughs> hey, that's a different <laughs> but, conversation, friend. Yes. But yeah, I totally mm. agree. I totally understand what you're yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah. So like, do I want to play this game? You know what? This is, <laughs> this is going to be a really expensive way and a very power hungry way for me to not decide what I'm going to play on Steam. <laughs> I was just thinking that. I was like, oh my gosh. Now that's we can all, all I ever do. If I ever have a moment, like you said about having a clock. Stare at our it's like, Steam do libraries. I want to get involved in this because I don't have a lot of time to play right now. Yeah, I so know. So I'm just going to have that, that same issue. I mean, I players. know. Just for, for me personally, the handhelds and I'm saying this with all the love in the world because number one, I, I, I want one <laughs> of these. <laughs> yes, yes. Number two, when I have a handheld, just for me in particular, I'm looking for like a quick gaming experience. Yeah. Although I have quick, I could do like three hours sitting like this, three, yeah. four hours sitting like this. Yeah. But if I'm gonna have like the moment, the vibe, you know what I mean? I, I kind of, you know, I yearn for a a larger experience, but gosh it darn does it, that's look pretty. pretty. It looks really pretty. Oh my gosh, can I have it in different oh, colors? Oh, we got more buttons back here too. Can I have a pink so, one? It's loaded with extra buttons, which is actually really good. How are those gonna work down here? Because uh, they'll just be your playing pinky? with your fingers. Yeah, fingers. Hmm. With your pinky and your ring finger down uh, here? Yeah, it's, like two it's like four paddles. You know, wow. some, some controls yeah. have a couple paddles. That's four of them. That's and you still lot. got two triggers, and then you got touch pads, which really opens it up to being usable for something like maybe civilization or something oh. you know like a game that and Love hopefully you have like some options to make it viewable maybe you have some like small screen mode or mm -hmm. you just make this resolution lower it's mm -hmm. a 1200 by 1280 by 800 mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. there's definitely ways this could work there you go there's a usb c there we go uh, for the power okay. um i'm assuming it'll have bluetooth audio i'm assuming Probably, yeah. you know it's mm -hmm. got a steam button that's awesome why do i love that i have to see it's better than netflix button i hit netflix my back well, all the time i have that Netflix button. Now, how much? Because there's several different yeah. versions and I want to see. Okay, we can reserve it. If you're going to reserve it. Okay. Okay. Oh, there's three different versions. Okay. Oh, and they each have different storage capacity and storage <laughs> rating. I like the one for $3.99. says, mm, carry in case. Carry in case. Yeah, that's about all has going. That's the ticket. <laughs> Steam okay. Community Profile Bundle. All right. Carry in right. case. And then anti glare etched glass. Virtual keyboard theme, exclusive theme, who cares about that? Uh, and fastest storage, <laughs> that's really like the selling point, keyboard right? That's like, deep. it's gonna be the best performer. Yeah, and it's yeah. gonna have 512 gigs, 64 gigs. You're gonna have to like delete and reinstall games all the time. Some games you won't be able to play at all. Um, so two feet, unless it has expandable storage, we got a lot to look at in this one, What do one, you think, think of that price point? I think it's about what I expected. Um, if, you, yeah. if, if 650, if it's decent at playing games yeah. and you can dock it yeah. and use it like a, a good general PC and yeah. pick it up and go, that's actually really, really cool. Yeah. I mean, that's really cool. I'm very excited and, about this. And you know what? People are buying them up. I'll bet they are. Like, I mean, this fast. If They're this reserving what it them. Says, I was I mean, just this is reading a, about it a little a while really ago. Cool of course, thing. I don't have it on. But. A PC Switch. I mean, for me, that's like, it's, it's, it's made for me. This is made for me. Steam, to me, though, is so overwhelming. And I just read somebody yeah, say so a little while ago, and I love this idea to not buy a new game until you complete one or start from the bottom of your list, so the oldest game, and just work your way through, just tick your way down. I, because, would, I would love to do that, uh, but that's like... I know. Like, the Steam library is an overwhelming place. Yes. Not unlike a regular library, <laughs> I'd like to point out. However, it's so, it's really overwhelming. I yeah. have spent many a night just looking and looking and going to the store and reading reviews and I'm like oh this person's really snarky just steam in general is a place to get lost in yeah and that kind of scares me for the handheld get in and get out mindset yeah. that I kind of roll with in my day to day you have to kind of mentally separate out like a library of games that you're actually going to play yeah, you put yeah. them in your favorites I, I always cycle things out that I just don't think I'm going to do yeah and then if you concentrate on that mm -hmm. and say I want to get in get out I had to pick something from this little list <laughs> this is this is a test of self-discipline yeah folks. that's true do this you guys is, have any methods for this yeah it is if you got uh if you guys have any methods 
for this, can't talk today. Uh, put it in the comments because yeah. it's so easy. Like those steam sales are just unreal. Yeah. You know, it's just like, oh, and you just pick up a nice little whoop. Yep. And it's, you know, it's time consuming and it's lovely and we love gaming and I'm here for it. And that being said, I think we should get one. And this is also an interesting statement, I think, that kind of runs contrary to where a lot of people are headed, which mm. is cloud gaming being the yes, thing. Yes, of course. So this is like, no, yeah, you're going to yeah, hold yeah. the hardware. You're going to yes. play it locally. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So that's interesting. Yeah. It's, it's an interesting play to come up right. with that hardware now when everybody else is really going to cloud gaming. Right. Mm. Mm. What do you guys think? Will you be playing God of War and sweating? Holding a hot microwave in your hands? We shall see in December 2021. We shall but guess see. what? Nobody's going to be able to get one. No, they're going to sell out like you crazy. You know what I mean? Yeah, We're all yeah. going to be like, who got one? It's going to be like the PS5. I think his reservations but, are already hey. selling on eBay. Yeah. Oh, God. Man. They're always scalping racket. reservation. I hate people. You know? I hate people. So, is what it Let is. us know your thoughts in the comments, please. <laughs> and thank you for indulging us on this quick little video while we uh, took a look at this stuff. Absolutely. All right. <laughs> We're going to have some other videos coming up soon. Yes, But in the meantime, soon. don't forget to watch us on Twitch. And we are back in the present. Okay. And if you like this video, please support us on Patreon. Click like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Thanks. Bye. Boy, it was faster than you. I'm sorry. <laughs>